We begin day 17 with something that you guys didn't believe I would ever do. Sticking to my word, the Phil Foden trim is coming. Looking sharp, man. I finally did it. Thoggy boy gets the Foden trim. I don't know if it suits me too much, but we've done it. I said if we win the World Cup, we'll bleach it. Going to be looking sharp for Morocco, Spain. Today's going to be a good game. Morocco have had an incredible journey. Let's get into the stats and see how they're going. Now back to the football. As the dark horses of this tournament, Morocco, arguably the best fans, end 36 years of World Cup disappointment by finally progressing to a knockout phase of the tournament. Manager Walid Regragui has challenged his players to aim for the sky and dream of lifting the famous trophy. I mean, why not? They topped Group F and they're unbeaten in the last four World Cup matches. And they could become the first African nation since Cameroon in 1990 to go five straight games undefeated at a World Cup. Luis Enrique's Spanish side can at least boast avoiding defeat in each of the three previous head-to-head -head meetings between both sides, which ended in two Spain wins. The one to watch, you could mention Pedri and Gavi holding down that midfield with Busquets, but none can better Alvaro Moreta's minute-to-goal ratio, which is 42 for Spain. Let's go to Education City. This could go either way. Thoughts on my trip? Out of 10? Yeah. No, it's extremely sharp. Where's Theo gone? Because I can only see Phil Foden. Cat in the elevator. There's like... a cat in the elevator, yeah? You've got the same trim as me now. Look, we've copied each no, other. No, you have the same trim as me. Today could be upsets galore. Switzerland and Morocco are both respectable sides, playing Portugal and Spain. They've both been unconvincing in their group stage. I think Switzerland are the most likely um, upset because they actually played really well in their last game. Excuse me, do I look like Phil Foden? <laughs> Yes, you do. I look like Foden, yeah? Okay, thank you. Foden, bro. One out of one. One out of one. He was happy to say that as well. Oh, Last man, though, from Argentina. Come on, Argentina. Vamos, Argentina. Vamos, vamos, lo necesitamos. Are you going to win the World Cup? Yes, maybe. Maybe. Every game, it comes. you've got to take every game as it comes. Step by step. Yeah, step by step. It won't be the same without Morocco out. They carried the atmosphere, they made it here, the sun is dawning. Is that England flag at all Foden? No. It looks like a haircut. It's a good haircut Foden. We're not even inside. This is the busiest it's been walking to a stadium. The amount of police there as well. I've not seen this at a World Cup match at all. Well, there's obviously a heated history between Morocco and Spain anyway. If you think about it, they've got a little outcrop in Africa where you know, that counts as European territory and there's always people trying to climb over that fence, a lot of African immigrants, people running away from war, legitimately as well. That rivalry is going to kick in today. 86, they got to this point. But for most people's lives, they haven't ever seen success this high. Morocco won Spain. Who's winning? Who's winning? Morocco, of course. Morocco? Yeah. Morocco, of course. Whoa! Spain, of course. But, of course. Uh, it will be, it will be very, <laughs> very difficult. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Two one. Why are Morocco fans the best fans at the World Cup? Because they love their country. Second final match here. The quarterfinals of Netherlands against Argentina. Crazy game. Do I look more like Phil Foden? Or is he yet? Phil Foden. I look like Foden? Yeah. Okay. And his brother? Honestly, Foden. <laughs> What's your... Dos yeah. Ceros. Go on, mate. Phil Foden at the stadium. Today, we've got... Oh, nine, is that really you? Bro, you're a football hero, man. Can we get to take a picture? Wait, is that really. Oh my god. Who are you meeting, who am I? Phil Foden, amazing! Ronaldo, British Ronaldo! <laughs> Zero Morocco. Come on, man, come on, good luck. Welcome to Education City. There we go, we're in. The fans are ready. Moroccans buzzing. This is the man behind the scenes. Oh, what's up, baby? Do you ever get, get tired? Do you ever get tired? You know why? Because right. we're in Morocco! <laughs> I had to say hello to that guy. He's the one that does all the videos, Brie Mac. I don't know how he has the energy. I've got my friend here, Moroccan yeah. fan, legend. Come on! I've gained a bit of a Moroccan fan base from the last few videos. 
and I can't thank you enough for that. Soak in this atmosphere, it's just unbelievable. You hear the squeals around me, it's just insane. Balls in! Morocco have a chance to make it 1 0, and it's one of the best chances of the game. They are the dark horses for a reason. It's half time, 0 0. We're at a good position. Um, we we enter a little bit scary after our stay. Yeah. Uh, we uh, the more we play, uh, the get the better we get. Oh, yeah. The game is getting more and more cagey as we get on. Whistles from all around the stadium. 69th minute, still nil nil. Spain dominating possession. The motion's running wild. Morocco's defence is doing everything that they can to hold this in. This is why they've got six clean sheets in the last seven games. Four minutes left until added time, and then it's looking like extra time. And they've got the defence of the fans. That's full time. They can breathe. Nil nil. I am still backing. Morocco to cause an upset. As much as this game has been unreal, I'm missing Portugal because of extra time. Still got a completely impossible challenge. We've got to remember that going to every match. If you're watching this, yeah. know that we are friends. The moment for Morocco. No. Ansu Fati is back. Williams on one wing, Fati on the other. Half time in extra time, nil nil still. Every time the keeper walks near the fans, they let him know they're there. Spain on the attack, but now it's Morocco, and he's through. Surely, just a tip. No! 115th minute, and it's still nil nil. I'm Moroccan for the next 10 minutes. Bad to end. Three minutes additional time and we go to penalties. This is one of those unbelievable foot matches. It's going to go right down to the wire. I have no words. We don't have any experience to face this kind of game. Yeah. And Spain at the opposite. It's coin toss. Yeah. Who takes the best pens? Yeah. Which way the keeper dives? Now I'm backing Morocco. And I bet you they will. The winner of this shootout plays the winner of Portugal, Switzerland later. Three up first. <laughs> Bench. Penalty takers never score off the bench. I don't even have to say it. He's missing. He's right. Calm down. Nothing's complete. Getting a little bit emotional.
and set the North African nation alive. Create one of the best football moments we have seen at the World Cup. Sending them to the final eight countries in the biggest tournament in football. He was crying.